Well then guys, it's now just gone 3 o'clock and uh, basically uh, me and Cheryl have been sitting here now racking our brains and going on, going through everything about this new... I should say it's not new, it's been in it's been in place since the end of the 90s apparently and this Ch Child Online Protection Act, known as COPPER um, it was enforced back in the late 90s and early 2000s and uh, since then everything's been like quiet and nothing's really come about of it and then all of a sudden in september youtube and google get hit with this massive fine and um basically now youtube has basically said they're washing their hands of everything else so it all comes down to the creator now so if the creator puts something up for kids you know and they say it's not for kids they're liable for a 42 is it million or thousands, Joe? Forty-two thousand pounds. Forty-two thousand US dollars per fine. Yeah, it's forty. It's forty-two thousand dollars per video fine, if you're in breach of something that could be for kids. Um, um, it could be anything. It could be any video that could get flagged. You know, we've gone through our videos this afternoon, and thanks to TubeBuddy, which I advise you guys to. Go in and have a look. Um, nearly 60 videos of ours, which have been labelled up as not for kids, have been labelled up as for kids by YouTube. And uh, you imagine a fine on each one of those. You you can't do it, can you? What? It's just ridiculous, you know. The thing mm. is, some of them, like... I can't, I can't see you there. You're going to have to come over here. Oh, that's fine, because I'm doing the wash. I'll stop the washing out anyway. But one of them was... Disney Nice we went to. Now Disney Nice is for everyone. Disney Nice is still for kids. Disney is for kids, Gerald. Okay, then what about we went to um one of the one of the other ones labelled was um one there at Quayton, the Thomas, wasn't That's it? Thomas the tank engine, it's for kids. Yeah, but also we it's also, for kids. We filmed the museum there, didn't we? That's the thing. Yeah, I know, but it doesn't it's... matter. It doesn't matter what's gonna happen, guys. It looks like it's it, YouTube's time it's... on the it's I don't know what to say, but it's coming to an end, really. I think it is. Thing because is, no, no one can justify having a fine. You they know can't. that. They can't. Thing is, also, um, people have got to be careful. Those I know people who do like shopping hauls and things like that. We actually done a shopping haul from B and M, didn't we? No mm. form of toys, no nothing in it. It's been labelled up for kids. With it's a shopping haul. Because they probably think kids like watching shopping hauls. Thing is, all the was on there. Shopping hall things like some or sweets. Kids like watching you walk around B and M showing stuff off. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's what it was. It was some sweets and some that yeah, sort but of thing, wasn't it? And that... smelly things. So I warn you guys. Um, do definitely to go into Creative Studio. There's a copper section up there. Do check that out big time because, like I said, we can't afford two thousand dollar fine per video. And um, so yeah, so at the minute we're still going to keep them as for them or for now, aren't we? Because yeah. we're hoping them, we're hoping them, praying that maybe um, they change their mind. So there is a petition going round. So definitely sign that. And also the FTC are taking comments, aren't they, as well, after sixth of December. So um, put this way, I do think YouTube and kids content, or even say family content, because that's the thing. We don't aim our videos at yeah, but kids. It's still at families and it's at kids, uh, Cheryl. Exactly. So yeah. So I do. Uh, I know quite a few. You know, anyone with gaming channels, and I know, I know quite a few people that I know who have gaming channels. You know, exactly. uh, like FIFA and uh, things like Minecraft and Roblox, Roblox, and, and even and even like Forza Horizon or those sort of channels. Like Forza they, channels, yeah. yeah. You know, all those are going to be dead in the water because what's going to happen is, if you set your channel for made for kids, basically. From January the 1st, and if this rule goes through, you're going to disappear off the face of the platform. You're going to lose your comments. Your comments are going to go. End your live streams. Yeah. Your end screens. Your, 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 your info cards. Your info cards. Your community tab. Your community tab. Basically, your modernization will be cut by 85% as far as I'm hearing on here. Yeah. Basically, you're dead in the water. Yeah, and also, YouTube won't promote you anymore either. So, please, people out there, even if you aren't a family vlogger, or anything like that, please sign this petition. It's thing is, they're rather promote sex and violence on YouTube. That's what they want to do, basically, create YouTube into an adult's content. I'll be nasty. I think, you know, you know, I understand why they're doing it because um, there are some videos on here which I've had to tell Sammy off for watching, especially some of these Forza ones where 
these people are swearing in them you know they shouldn't do it so that's their own fault really for do, for swearing in these videos why do you have to swear in these videos there's no logist about it is there no i can understand that i can understand on that one that thing because um no it's yes excuse like i'm afraid anyway thing is what i don't understand is why isn't parent permission enough you know what i mean yeah. and because i know with us with sammy he says all oh, about can i go on computer can i go on this like on yes that's fine but also one of his apps he's got on his tablet the parent has to put in their date of birth in don't they to prove that they've given the permission so why enough can't you two do something like that where you type in your date of birth or something like know. that you've got to it's... remember this day and age technology rules the roost with kids it does do you know if you take it away you're gonna have world war three and that's it um, is in, yeah you you are not gonna hear the end of it no we're not what does the ftc want all these kids to do sit around with a freaking jigsaw oh, and no. go back to the 80s when no. there was nothing i know they want uh, they obviously they want all the like the kids content and stuff like that to go on to the kids app I'm not being nasty i've never seen sam on the kids app with you he never no. has because the content he likes like his gaming streams blah, blah, blah. they're not on youtube they're not on the kids app yeah. are they it's just crazy yeah. no well you know, guys, I don't know how we're going to approach the, the coming days. Um, I don't know if me and Cheryl are going to... I don't know what we're going to do, are we? I don't know what we're going to do. We're going to have to talk about it. Obviously, we'll let you know anyway what we decide to do, won't we? So... But one thing I can say is that if it's going to go like this, there's going to be no more out and about. No. There's not going to be no more like filming. Like You're not going to even see what we're going to have for Christmas this year because no. that's going to be flagged up. Even... Uh, one of the videos that got flagged up was putting up the Christmas tree from last year. You won't even see that either. There you go. Let's just go to prove to you. I've got an A4 sheet, both sides here, of contents, um, things have been flagged. One of the things was, um, I, can, I, can, I suppose I can understand that when we got the um, toy, the um, that body frame. I can understand that being flagged. Yeah, but you put that as paid promotion. I put that as a paid promotion, which it was a paid promotion, yeah. And, um, Obviously, like, haircuts for the boys, when we get the boys' haircuts. I don't understand how that's been flagged, because, obviously, back of the flags of the channel know the boys got special needs. And you thought, how on earth would the kid be interested in having the haircut, you know? It's just, okay. it's just me. Another, another thing is, our Butlins vlogs have been, a couple of those have been flagged. Again, everyone enjoys Butlins, you know? Yeah, I know, but it's still... It just doesn't make sense. It's still a this. kid's place, because not being nasty, um, Disney is for kids. Disney promotes their on their adverts for kids. So basically, yeah, they're they're, they're shoving it down a kid's throat. What, how are they not breaking the rules when it comes to this? I know. No. But what gets me is one of our recent vlogs was um deals at Waitrose. How on earth that get flat? Because all I was doing was shopping my dad in Waitrose. Yeah. What did you did you show anything that could be suitable for a kid? In no, it? I didn't. That's the question. So yeah, but how do you know without going back on it? I know. But anyway, yes. Yeah, so guys, we're going to have. That's a big discussion what we're going to do, so... It's like if Cheryl does her Disney Disney DVDs, that, that could be great for kids. So look, it's Toy Story or exactly, something like yeah. that. Exactly, yeah. You just don't you know, know anymore. Bang, here's a fine for you. Exactly, yeah. Mm. So the dear guys, please do go and um, sign the petition and also the FTC. Because obviously it's... They basically, they just want YouTubers and adults content only, basically, don't they? Yeah, they'd rather promote the wrong thing than... Exactly, yeah. The right thing. Anyway, guys, yeah, um, I don't know where we're going forward, but I can tell you now the daily vlogs are going to be stopping, aren't they? They are big time, yeah. The daily vlogs are going to be stopping because I can't take the risk, and uh, if it gets to the point where the risk gets really high, then the channel's going to go all together. And um, I feel sorry for it because um, we both worked hard with it. I started it back in 2009 doing DVD and Blu-ray reviews, and back then our highest highest ever video is one of them was 234,000 views on it right now Cheryl doing a Disney collection because if that gets flagged up then that, that, that's gone anyway yeah um, um, I hope it's been a blast for you guys because um, I don't know how to go ahead and go forward to the future because when you're watching the YouTube video and they say oh you need to consult a lawyer about going through about stuff for kids what's good for the kids and not you know <clears throat> you can't take the risk anymore so i don't know how to approach this so anyway um 
Cheryl just is really upset because she's worked hard on it. She's stayed up for so many hours. She's put so many hours into it, you know, you know, staying up till late at night waiting for the computer to upload videos to YouTube and, you know, the, the amount of encoding that goes on with everything. And, uh, you know, it's not just going to be all this other thing that's going to lose out. It's going to be all these other things like we use our music from Epidemic Sound and they're going to lose out as well if all these content creators go and you know what about all these people that rely on this for their for basically their full-time job you know it, it was always said you know don't rely on this to do it because one day it'll be gone and it looks like it's slowly starting to edge that way so <clears throat> anyway guys i don't know if this is going to be the end of today's video or not or you'll see in a few moments but um for now i'll see you soon Don't walk away Ooh, Don't walk away